the renewable energy technology using windmill and solar power created by UKM researcher is expected to be used on more than 20 remote islands in the waters bordering between Malaysia. The use of windmill and solar energy absorbing PV panel hybrid system was the result of research, design and creation by UKM Solar Energy Research Institute, Suri, which will substitute the use of diesel power energy generating stations and be expected to overcome the various problems, especially in logistics and costs. The proposal is being discussed between Suri and the Royal Malaysian Police, PDRM, responsible for manning the remote border outposts at these strategic islands. Suri Research Fellow and Head of Industrial and Social Network, Dr. Sahif Bin Mat, said a memorandum of understanding on the proposal is hoped to be signed soon. In a recent interview at Suri's, he stated that PDRM has patrol and control stations at more than 20 small and remote islands bordering Sabah and the Philippines. Apart from protecting our national sovereignty, those stations can also act as a lookout for pirates and terrorist threats. Pulaus are very, very remote. Nah, very remote. And normally some stations are the orang, are the 14 orang, ada 12 orang and they don't have uh, apa tu, supplies of electricity uh, as well as food unless they unless they uh, they apa they per, uh, apa, ex, apa ni, ambil daripada mainland lah, Sabah so they, are, they, they uh, mereka ini ada live, ada living quarters uh, dengan all the telecommunication centers and so forth and they are at the moment generated uh, using apa tu using uh, genset lah genset jadi bila guna genset ni uh, mereka perlu dalam seminggu setiap kali sekali seminggu pergi ke Sabah pakai marine high speed boat tu <laughs> uh, bawa uh, diesel dan juga bawa makanan dan air daripada sempurna ke Tawau area dan sebagainya Ya, jadi, jadi kami telah mengadakan uh, dua tiga kali perbincangan dengan Bukit Aman dan mereka amat menghargai kerjasama kami dan akan mem, uh, 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 dan amat bersetuju lah supaya kita dapat bekerjasama dengan PDRM supaya uh, mereka dapat merasai uh, apa tu, uh, uh, penggunaan tenaga keterbaharuan uh, di dalam uh, poli sendiri. At the moment, Suri have three prototype windmills. One is recently set up at Marine Ecosystem Research Center Ikoma in Mersing. Another will be installed at Sabah, while the third one at Langkawi. Each is 30 feet tall with three blades. It is conceived of 5 kilowatt type turbine and largely dependent on the strength and speed of the wind. It can generate more power if it's continued for 10 to 12 hours per day. At that speed, it can have a high commercial value since it will be able to generate around 60 to 100 kilowatt hours per day. Dr. Sahif said that PV solar panel enable the generator to harvest and store the solar energy during the day, between 4 to 5 hours, and add it together with the energy generated by the windmill. The PV panel can be used up to 30 years, while the lifespan of the windmill's turbine battery is up to 10 years. Dr. Sahif hopes that the cooperation between UKM and the builder of the windmill, by Corps Number Hut, and PDRM will be a success and pave the way in using renewable energy by other sectors.